So more helpful hints for living outside. Um, you know, anyway, like I was saying, uh, you know, your socks, you're gonna wanna keep those dry and fresh as much as possible. So I take them off during the day. I have those shoes to run around in and I'm really glad I got those. Those $10 sneakers really have served me well. And I have flip flops as well so that I can take a shower or, you know, just go back and forth. It's, it's, it's good to have those kind of shoes. Uh, what else do I have? Oh, if you don't have pet bowls, you can use lids from, um, you know, fast food drinks. You can see I've got the cats hooked up here with some Starbucks lids for their pet bowls. What else do I got going on here? Um, this is a container. It's a carrier, but I have all my extra shit in it. So let me see. I have this. It's a solar powered charger, but it doesn't fucking work. So there's that, but this I have all my stuff in. So like my cards and I can throw everything in it real quick and either, you know, take off if needed because I keep getting shaken out of spots or, um, you know, keep it dry if it rains as well. That's another thing, guys, the blankets. I'm telling you, I don't know. I don't know what else to tell you guys. Oh, lighting, uh, depending on where you're at. You know, of course, everybody knows I carry these around and they're rechargeable. But, um, yeah, lighting and then also be prepared to fight for your stuff because people will steal your shit if you're charging it at, like, public outlets, you know. Um, so I, I like to put a note on mine that says, like, please do not steal, you know, God bless you. <laughs> and usually that deters people. But sometimes people steal. I had to go shake up some old homeless man last night for my phone and my charger. And I know he has my earbuds too, and I'm going to get him back. But yeah, he got scared. So I was like, Hey, I was like, give me my phone back. I didn't even ask questions. I was like, give me my phone back. Cause, cause it showed on the find my app that he had it. So anyway, be prepared to fight for your stuff. You're going to have to fight, you know, other people that are suffering and struggling for your belongings.